FIFA 14 was the year of some absolutely iconic moments and videos like these. It was also the year for some iconic cars like this Bia Biani and this Abamyang. In FIFA 14, Suso was also a wonder kid who was 74 rated with a potential of 89. Now in FIFA 23, Suso has this lovely looking special card and around him, we're going to build a full team of FIFA 14 wonder kids in FIFA 23. But in order to do that, the challenge is simple. Get an assist with Suso. Suso driving, beats one, lays him in. Come on, if we can finish this, we can get it done. Nope. Okay, no, we can't. Suso wins the ball. He's done one, slips him in. Come on, this could be the assist here. If we can score, which we can. Come on, there's the assist straight away. Simple as second attempt, Bosch. Let's get into adding the next Wonder Kids into the team. The second FIFA 13 Wonder Kid going into the team is going to be Anthony Martial. In FIFA 14, he was 63 rated with a potential of 87. And he had a shocking trim at the time. Before we go any further, Suso starts with SU. What else starts with SU? Subscribe, and that's what you need to do. So click that subscribe button and enjoy the rest of the video. The third Third wonder kid going into the team is the perfect link with Anthony Martial. We're going with Rafa Varane. In FIFA 14, he was 81 rated with a potential of 88. The final wonder kid of this round is a little bit of a surprise. We have Jeffrey Bruma, who we are actually going to convert to a cam. Now in FIFA 14, he was 75 rated with a potential of 88. Now that's our first three additions around Suso, but how do we get three more? In the last round, we completed one challenge, so this time we're going to have to complete two. For the first challenge, challenge, we're going to have to score a finesse shot with Anthony Martial like he did on his Man United debut. And then secondly, with Rafa Varane, we have to win four tackles. Martial driving. Come on, finesse that there. Oh, we've done it first time. Martial with a finesse. Tony Martial, he came from France. The English press said he had no chance. Right, that's enough of my singing. Now with the Varane tackles. Here we go. Varane tackle. Here we go. There's one. Come on, Rafa. Varane. Oh, tackle number two. There it is. There is tackle number two. There's another one. Varane number three. Come on, can we get the one before the end of the game? The answer is no. So let's go into the next game and get that final Varane tackle. Here we have it then. Rafa Varane with the final tackle. And it's a big one. Let's go. We take it. And let's go and get the next three players in the team. The first of the next upgrades is going to be at goalkeeper. We are going with Bernd Leno, who at the time was also 80 rated, but had 85 potential. The next FIFA 14 wonder kid into the team for me was a little bit of a surprise. We're going with Inform Mitrovic, who also gets the Fulham link with Bernd Leno. Now in FIFA 14, he was 74 rated at Andelect and had a potential of 87. And then the final one of this batch is going to be Marco Verratti, who right now actually isn't on any chem. But in FIFA 14, he had a little baby face and he was 77 rated with a potential of 88. Now we have four positions left. And if you've watched the other Wonder Kids episode, you'll know the drill by now. We've done one challenge. We've done two challenges. So in order to get the final four players, we must do three. The three challenges are to score a header with Alexander Mitrovic, to get an assist with Marco Verratti, and then to make three plus saves with Bernd Leno. And then after that, we'll have the full Wonder Kids team. So stay tuned for that. Leno with a save. Come on. First save for Leno there. Come on. Still got two more though. Leno. Great save. Let's save number two for Leno. Come on. Leno, please. What a save. There's three saves for Leno. We've got none of the others so far, though. Full time, and we've got the Leno saves done, but uh, we didn't get any of the others, so let's go into game two. I'll be honest, I really struggled with the others. Come on, come on. Can we cross this here into Mitrovic to win a header? Mitrovic header! There it is, finally. We've got the Mitrovic header. Now all we need to do is get the Verratti assist. Great off the kickoff from the goal into Mitrovic. Back into Verratti. Into Martial. Denied. Martial. Oh, close. Almost that Verratti assist. Into Mitrovic, please. The assist. How have you missed? Verratti through ball. Into Mitrovic, please, man. Get the assist, finally. We've done it. All three challenges done. Let's go and get the final four players in the team. The first of the final four changes and Wonder Kids going into the team is going to be Marquinhos at centre-back. In FIFA 14, he was 78 rated with a potential of 89. He's pretty much lived up to it. At right-back, we have Juventus right-back Danilo. 
In FIFA 14, he was 77 rated with a potential of 84. It was also pretty hard to find an actual right back who was a wonder kid at the time. So 84 potential is the best we got. The left back is going to be Rekic, who is actually a centre back, but he does have a secondary position of left back. So if we apply a consumable, bang, he's our left back. In FIFA 14, he was 73 rated and at Man City with a potential of 83. And then the final wonder kid we have going into the team is going to be Isco, who gets the perfect link with Suso. In FIFA 14, he was already 84 rated with a potential of 88. And now he's an 82 rated. Had a good career though, I suppose. And bang. That's your FIFA 14 Wonder Kids in FIFA 23. If you've made it this far, then you're an absolute goat. And I want you to comment down below the word cupcake. We've done donut, so it's time for the cupcake gang. And if you've enjoyed it so much, then click this video here and watch FIFA 13 Wonder Kids. Peace.